I'm Ryan. I'm Nate. And today we're going to be going over some of our favorite EDC gear that we have in the shop. We're going to try and see whose is better. Me. And then down in the comments, you guys can decide on which ones you think. All right. Okay. I'm going to need about one second. Uh, so, Nate, go ahead and tell us about your knife. Sure, Ryan. I, uh, I picked the CEO Bamboo. It's a cool little knife, great for pocket carry, great for opening envelopes, boxes, super lightweight, thin, and extremely sharp. And a very, very slim profile for uh, stabbing your enemies in the conference room. Yes. Yeah, yes. right? Absolutely. Don't do that. I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> my knife that uh, I picked out is from CRKT. It's uh, called the PSD. That is the particle separation device. This is my everyday carry. I, whenever we got it in the shop, I was like, this is really cool. It has a uh, drop point blade with everything with the VEF serrations on there, all blacked out. It's got some blue accents. And then I got one of our cool custom lanyards that we have here in the shop because I just have to be a little extra with it because I like it. But very, very cool, very, very sharp, very, very pointy. Yes. But great for everyday carry. Absolutely. Um, let's see. Going into the next one with it, let's go into our OLIDs. Nate, which one did you pick? Well, uh, I picked the I3T EOS Titanium Damascus OLIDE. It's a uh, 180 lumen OLIDE. I actually daily carry this because it's super badass. It um, has a Titanium Damascus pattern on it. Just looks really pretty. Great, light, That's easy awesome. to carry. Keep it in my pocket right there. Well, very nice. Well, um, I went with uh, the Marauder 2, and uh, it's my uh, everyday carry in the back of the pocket. No, I don't do that. That'd be you ridiculous. You notice the theme here where Ryan's kind of overcompensating. <laughs> it's just a little bit. Yeah. But you should see his truck nuts. Exactly. This thing is just completely overpowered for the size that it is you wouldn't think that it has um the amount of power behind it but this is great for hunting right this is a this is specifically meant if you're going out camping backpacking hunting uh this thing has a 14,000 lumen max on it and an 800 meter throw this thing uh has the ability to do a floodlight and a spotlight feature we may have uh almost caused a traffic accident with it by accident i wasn't uh, here It's a great flashlight. It's also rechargeable. So this is one, if uh, you're looking for a cool flashlight to take out to the woods, take camping, take hunting, this thing will illuminate a very large distance and you won't have to worry about falling in a giant hole out in the woods. So Boom. <laughs> that's my cell point on it. Cool. Uh, and then going into gear, Nate, your favorite gear that you kind of have here in the shop. Yeah, you know me, I like to support local. Um, we got a local company called Element X Outdoors and they make these really cool little fire discs that uh, you can take out into the woods and start a fire with. And uh, they're real convenient, they're waterproof, food safe, little disc like this, and they'll actually light on top of water, and we'll give you a little demonstration now. It's science time, All right, here we go. Got a fire disc right here. What we're gonna do first is break the wax seal on it. That's what keeps it waterproof. So, I'm going to bend it back and forth a few times. You can even tear it if you like. Another technique we can use is scuff it up here in the center. Just to open that bad boy up. And you can use your flint striker, a match, a lighter, your crack pipe torch, whatever to light it. I've got a crack pipe torch. Boom. There we go. And we have fire. Thanks for joining us in our science lesson today. With that, uh, great little fire starting disc. We may or may not have uh, lit it in the shop to test it. We did. It was great. We were able to time it. And so we have variation of the burn times with it. With this specific uh, system that you have, so if you get five discs for, for the package, right? So each one of these, we timed it with like the burn time between like what, like 10 and 14 minutes? For yeah, on time. average, anywhere between 10 to 14 minutes. We've seen one burn as long as 18 minutes. Right. 
Um, but uh, yeah, that's kind of your average, which is more than enough to get your fire started if you're out in the woods. Right. So awesome, awesome thing that we got going on. Yeah. For more uh, every day, uh, going out in the town, going out and driving around, uh, we actually make my item for everyday carry, uh, gear that we do here in the stop, in the shop actually. We actually make these. Uh, these are our Kydex wallets. Nate and Billy uh, came up with the design for these. You can actually fit eight to ten cards and the cutoff with it. And you may think, okay, well that's slim. How does it work? Is it like one of the uh, the other wallets where you have to push a button and everything comes out or you have to pull all your cards out to get to your own card? You don't, right? No. So with these, you actually just fan it to find the card you need and then you take the card out and then you use it and then when you put it back in, that's all it takes. And then the band, Nate, you came up with the band idea. Why did you do the band on there? Well, I found that without the band, um, because the Kydex is so smooth and um, kind of slippery in your pocket, um, the rubber band helps to keep it secured in one spot once you put it in your pocket. Um, the other thing that it doubles as is kind of a money clip, so you can kind of strap right. some money down there. I never have that. My wife usually has Takes all the money. Yeah. Yeah. Us guys usually have that problem. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But... Uh, great all-around wallet. They come in different colors and styles because it's the same thing we do with all of our holsters that we make here in the shop. All the holsters can come in different colors. Same thing with the wallets. If you want a pink camouflage wallet, we'll get you one. If you want a black carbon fiber, we can get you one. So something really, really cool, really, 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 really minimalistic that I carry around, Nate carries around, every one of us here at the store, at the store carries around. So an awesome little uh, EDC wallet to have whenever you go out and on the town. So Absolutely. with that... Uh, those are kind of our favorite gears that we have here in the shop. If you've been by or if you've seen everything on the website, kind of, you know, shoot down in the comments, see whose uh, who's list is better. <laughs> Maybe Nate won't hurt me again. So uh, pick it up in the comments. Uh, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, if you guys have any questions, shoot them over. If you have any questions about any of the gear that you see here and you want to see if we can get one sent out to you, shoot us over a question in the comments or call the store. But other than that, Nate, I think I'm good with it. You good with it? I'm good with it. Okay, we're going to go have a knockdown drag out in the backyard. Yep. All right, bye. See ya. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Appreciate you watching till the end. And just for doing so, anybody that sees this last segment of our video and comes into the shop and mentions it gets a free SIG P365 tech mat. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time, guys.